the other day I was cleaning out my wardrobe right here and I found old modeling portfolios and I thought what a fun video to do to recreate some of my old model pictures um a bit nervous because obviously I haven't modeled for a while now so it's a bit weird to have a look through um just a little basically these are what you would give to a casting director or whoever's booking you on the job they'd have a look through it and they'd be like mm, yeah no I didn't really explain the video but basically my brother was helping me to recreate the photos and we just picked a few from my portfolio I was modeling for about three or four years um so obviously this is all taken from my portfolio when I finished modeling so there were lots of pictures that I could have included um but I just picked the ones that were in my book at the time so there were way more that I could have maybe done that would probably would have been more exciting but this is what I did instead. I'm gonna do all the ones with my hair down first. And lots of the shoots that I did, they actually had very natural makeup, like they didn't barely do anything. And this one in particular, which was a really nice team to work with, is in town, which is these, this, this, this. this. Obviously, I didn't have any makeup in these. So I'm gonna be recreating those ones first, because they're, I think, one of the easier ones to recreate. And we're gonna try and do it. I think it's gonna be semi-easy. There's nothing down there from the ceiling either, right? Yeah, well, that's fine. I can't do it, it's so weird. Sorry, it's really weird being serious. Oh, it's a bit. <laughs> it's so weird. Right. I feel like I need to have. It's like my neck looks shorter in it. Is my neck growing? Go this? Yeah, my neck looks shorter. No, it's longer in that. You can be a star as well, Banks. You can be my model kitty. Love you. Okay, cool. We've got it, surely. Next one, next one, next one, next one. Okay, so the picture we're going for here is this one. And I just brushed my hair and that's really static, so it might be a bit tricky. But we're gonna give her a go. Right. I think I might need a different jumper that I can hold up more easily. I did a few jumpers and I can't find the right one. Can you tell I'm biting it if I go like this? Not really. Okay. You look sad, man. Really sad. <laughs> My eyes watered up. <laughs> kind of. Better. It's more. My hair's more in my face, isn't it? Hi, punks. So we're gonna do this one. Um, I'm gonna put the outfit on. I think it's because I look young here. I don't think I'm gonna be able to recreate that. But we'll give it a go. So I've got a perchy thing. I don't even know how. Get my head around how the angle. So that's like that. How do I make my like what way? Do you know what I mean? I just. I think you're overthinking it, aren't you? I think it goes that way. And you look a little bit like a dude. Yeah, I go. You see it that a lot in modelling. <laughs> I don't know why. Is it the short hair bit? But you don't even have short hair. It's called androgynous. <laughs> That's what I mean. The angles are so hard to work out. A proper shoot is so much easier. That's because the cameraman knows what he's doing. You've got a jawbone there, but you don't normally have one. Rude. <laughs> yeah, but that bit. I've never seen that part of your face before. <laughs> Yeah, slightly better. You can crop out the top. Last time I did a video about modelling, I had some people being like, I can't believe you were model. I remember I was an editorial model, which meant that I wasn't like a commercial, like pretty, big boobs, that sort of blonde bombshell. I was editorial, so it's very different, okay? All you haters, rude. Okay, I don't get how what, how my hair... Anyway, we're going to be trying this one now. Uh, so this is what it is. So we're going to have to venture outdoors. Get outside. Just out there. And also, you need to come down. You're taking it from like up here. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> <laughs> it's weird. Like but now you're taking it from down here. Right. Just be straight on. I'm trying. <laughs> Ding down. Swiper, no swiper. Swiper. My legs are killing me. Turn it, turn it, turn the picture. Turn the pic. Not that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wow. What a diva. Sit down, Grace. He's trying to help you. I found the picture that we were laughing at and I have to include it because it is so funny. Jesse, let's just say, Jesse being a photographer isn't probably his uh, route to go down. Or, or I shouldn't blame Jesse and I know that I've gone into the right career in baking, leaving modelling behind. That? Okay. See my I'm hair? Sorry. I know, but what? I can't do hair, can I? What am I supposed to do? <laughs> okay, I think we have to call this one off. Okay, oh here, kind of, wait. So I am realised I'm taking this all from like, mainly one shoot. Well, not one shoot, but... Because there are, there are many pictures that I took during my time modelling. Over like four different books. 
Yeah. And also, they take like 500 shots and they pick like one. Yeah. But also, what's weird is oh, the main reason I'm trying to pick ones that I can actually recreate because all of them have like different backgrounds, clothes. My legs were painted red. Love that. Not leggings. But that was actually with the best photographer, one of the best photographers. Yeah, already. Are you in the stupid? world. <laughs> Banksy, you've literally been out there for one wrong? second. I would love to have recreated this one. We'll That's in. Matt and Marcus. Big name on campus. Like that. Why? They're both big Matt and Marcus. Did you have that one? No, they wanted to, but they weren't allowed because I was exclusive. So it was a bit, but they really were trying to get me, but obviously you can't say when you're exclusive, so I couldn't say that I was an exclusive. Well, so then they just thought I was being difficult. That would make they, more sense. Why can't you do this? I'm exclusive. Okay, we'll stop asking. That is logical. Okay, let's do this puppy. So we just did another one. The, 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 the main things we've established are that we're using an iPhone. I clearly don't have it anymore. The knack. And we like to use excuses. And excuses, excuses, excuses. So we're going to try one last one. Let's do it, Jess. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Wait. You're just laughing at that stuff. I think that was what that was actually. I think I was laughing and they just caught it. Oh, they're right. Mm. Just go with it. Shut up. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna edit these and then we'll see. I feel like I need to do a compilation of my old modeling pictures at the end to show that I'm not inept. Maybe one day I can do it with a proper photographer, not yeah. my brother. And Ouch. Well, photographer versus brother, who gets <laughs> the best shots. Professional versus unprofessional. <laughs> and make up an art hair team. That'll be fun, but. At the moment, it's just me. Any sponsors out there? <laughs> just edited all the pictures, and let's just say, again, I tried to do this with the Avril Lavigne one, but I took the video down because it was so tragic, but I'm not the best editor, and obviously we're doing this on an iPhone, and they have, A, they have proper editing software, I literally just use my iPad. Please forgive the tragic outcomes of the pictures. So we had the first one, which was the one where I was like, in the tracksuit and whatnot. This one actually came out okay. It was okay. I'll put them on the screen. As you can see, I did the like grainy black and white thing. That was okay. The next one is shocking. You can laugh, it's fine. I'm just gonna put it on screen, I'm not even gonna explain it. Basically, you don't want explanations, you just wanna see the pictures. And it is tragic, absolutely tragic. Then the next one, again, doesn't look anything like the picture. I do not have a HDR camera thing, so we couldn't achieve this one how I wanted it. And the hair, the hair just the hair wasn't cooperating as we wanted it. Now this, the next one is honestly the worst one of all. Like, I tried to make the background different. I just, I don't even want to put this one in, but I have to because we attempted it and it's laughable. And then the last one as well, my head just wouldn't go in the right angle. Is it safe to say that photographers, hair, and makeup teams know what they're doing. Give them credit where credit is due because they know what they're doing. They did a cracking job of making me look actually presentable. Evidently, I'm not that presentable. So, anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this mashup of a video. Subscribe, like, all that jazz. Follow me on Instagram where you can see more candid iPhone pictures of me that are tragic. So, have your lots. Peace out.